What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So we're going to jump into it right away here. The reason you guys clicked this video is because you want to know how to connect multiple peripherals to two different devices, whether that be a laptop and a PC, two PCs, a Mac and a PC, whatever combination you have, you want to learn how to connect a, a microphone and a mouse, maybe a mouse and a webcam, or even just a mouse and a keyboard at the same time to these different devices without having to unplug and replug the USB cable. Well, you can do that. And with this little device right here, I'll show you, you can see a little closer. Um, it lets you do that. With this little button right here, you have two cables that come in the box. So USB 3.0, which is this device. There are USB 2.0, so if you do want to connect just a mouse and keyboard, you don't need that additional bandwidth. Uh, that's fine. But this, like I said, 25 bucks. You can get it on Amazon. I'll put it in the description down below. Connect your computer A and computer B with these two USB 3.0 cables, and then you can connect whatever device you want and easily switch between them. So let's head over to my setup over here, and I'll show you guys how you can set this up in under five minutes. Welcome to the setup, guys. Here we have my MacBook and here we have my PC. Both of these connected to these monitors and I do happen to have the peripherals I'm gonna go ahead and connect today. So one being this microphone that I use on both devices. So whether I'm doing voiceovers, streaming, gaming, I'm always using this microphone and I always want it to be easier instead of having to unplug and then plug it back into my PC. And then I think I'm also gonna do the webcam for now. I may end up doing a wired mouse, but for now, I'm gonna go ahead and do the webcam just to show you guys what that looks like when you switch with this. All right, so behind the PC, I did pull it out a little bit so we can see what's going on. We have the USB 3.0 cable. So we can see these are the blue ones, and this is where we wanna go ahead and plug this in. So I'll go ahead and move that, and then I will go ahead and plug this cable in right here. And now we can go ahead and get it situated behind our desk. Here we have our little Ugreen switch device and here we have the cable from PC number one. We're gonna go ahead and pop that into input number one and that is set up. So as you can see, we have a little blue LED right here. And if I click it, we can jump between the two. So now all we gotta do is go ahead and connect laptop number two or computer number two, which is gonna be this Mac and we will be good to go. I did go ahead and get it plugged into the back of my Thunderbolt dock. So we're gonna go ahead and plug that in. And now this is essentially our setup for having our two devices. So we have PC and we have Mac and we can easily jump between the two devices that we plug into the front. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my web webcam and microphone plugged in here. So we gotta go ahead and find my other cable, which is right here. This one is my webcam and then we have my microphone. So right now we are on PC number one. So let me go ahead and shift you guys up and show you exactly what that is going to look like and then zoom out just a little bit. So on the left side here on this monitor, we have my PC and then on this is my Mac. So we have uh, the ability to see when we connect and press that button, how quickly this exactly happens. So right now, since we are plugged into the PC, Let's go ahead and get into our settings here to show you guys. So right now we can see on our devices and printers, we have the blue microphone and the Razer Kyo. And if I were to go ahead and click this button, just take note on the MacBook side, let's go get some focus there. We can see we have MacBook Pro microphone, iPhone microphone and USB advanced audio device. But as soon as I push this button, watch how quickly those transfer over to this side. Now in just a few seconds, they dropped off over there and we can now see we have Razer Kyo and in just a second, we have the uh, Yeti stereo microphone. And just real quick to show you guys exactly how fast this data can transfer, we have the webcam live right now. So you can kind of see behind the scenes on this screen. And I'm gonna go ahead and switch it over to my Mac and then pull up FaceTime so we can go ahead and just start using that camera right away. We're gonna go to video and select Razer Kyo Pro. And just like that, we are now using the Razer Kyo, and it literally took just a few seconds to switch between the two, so pretty dang quick. And that's really all there is to it. So this is the one I have that you saw in the video. I'll link it down in the description below, so if you guys wanted to pick up the same one, you can do so. I'll have a few others too, so if you don't need to have the high-speed USB 3.0 ports, I'll link a few that are 2.0. Uh, but it really doesn't matter which one you pick up. Uh, they all function relatively similar. These are just pretty compact. This is why I picked this one. And I really only wanted to connect two different devices. Uh, but with that being said, thanks so much for watching, guys. Hopefully this helped you connect those devices to your separate PCs. And if you enjoyed this video, let me know down in the comments below. If you want to subscribe to see more videos like this, definitely helps me out. But until next time, thanks so much for watching. See you guys later.